Oh, go in the hole. Yeah, go in the that. hole. Oh. 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 I think that got some holes. So guys, today we are playing the only USGA rated par three course in America. Can you guess what it is? No, it's not Augusta. In fact, that's only a nine hole course. Today we are gonna play all 18. And if you guessed Hamilton Farm, the Hickory course at Hamilton Farm, you're right. And guess what? We're also gonna throw a cherry on top. If anyone in the group playing today gets a hole in one, we are going to give one lucky subscriber a thousand bucks. That's right. We'll buy the round of drinks at your local bar with that thousand dollar tab. So wish us luck. We each have 18 shots at it. Let's go. Hey Mike, they start you off with an easy 220 into the wind. No easy. big deal, right? Simple. Simple jump That's out of the gate, right? <laughs> That's the way to start. Thousand. First grand right out of the gate. <laughs> Our money might be in danger today, Mike. Danger. All right. Here it comes. So this course, uh, the Hickory, the par three course, has the same designer as the Highland, which we played last fall, the big course here. And the designer here, Dana Fry, uh, also designed a little place called Aaron Hills. <laughs> so, marquee designer, and you're gonna see a little bit of all different design elements here. Here on the second hole, you can see bunkers everywhere. We're gonna see a little bit of water. We're gonna see, and, and like we saw at the big course, some of these bunkers very deep. But like I said, for a par three course, there are a lot of very unique design elements out here. Ooh. Be enough, be enough, be enough. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, oh, stay up. oh. Stay up. oh. <laughs> I thought we got away from Donnie Ross style greens. I know, right? False front. <sighs> that close, you came all the way back down. Hey, they all started in different spots. They all ended up in the yeah, same spot. Yeah, <laughs> Look at that. Oh, false front, baby. Introducing your Texas Wedge champion, both home and abroad. <laughs> Gotta stay up, gotta stay up. Ooh, mm. They took the crown away. <laughs> Look at this. gonna hit my ball. Look at this. Can you mark that? Yeah. Better, better pays. Oh, I'm gonna keep it up there even if I have to blow it by the hole. Exactly. All right, after two holes, the $1,000 is still safe, but we want to give it away. That's why we brought a couple of ringers out here with us. So, on to number three, let's go. What do we got there? Uh, what we got? <laughs> a special invitation. Tell us about that experience. It was awesome. Yeah, right, it that's probably awesome. the best word to describe. It was awesome. Fun? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Challenging? Extremely. Yep. <laughs> and want to go back and, and play can, better. Yep. It's you intimidating off the tee. Exactly, but you got the invite. I got the invite. How about you, Drew? You ever played there? I have. I have. I've been down there one time. It's been a few years, but I, I'd also like another crack at it. Yeah, right. Uh, I would like a, a crack. It's hey. a bear of a golf. It's a bear of a golf course, but it's best turtle soup in the world. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Turtle soup. What no. <laughs> no. Mike, my, my wallet gets nervous every time these guys I mean, hit the ball. Not when I hit, right? Yeah. No, just, just <laughs> when they fly. Just. <laughs> Oh yeah. Got a chance. Uh, uh, we can a little right. Jack. One time. Oh, what a birdie! Yes. Yes. Oh. Mike with the bomb of a birdie there. That was a good one, right? That's a good one. Now we got some water. Yeah, here. this looks like a little tricky one, huh? Yeah, it's a good one. 175 over water, just a uh, big giant bunker and a lake to cover. But other than that, you know, it's pretty simple. And That's also, all. We, we didn't forget to mention this skinny green, right? I mean, is there much to Yeah, no, this? it's at least uh, 12 or 15 paces wide in front. Uh, That's all. Ve fairly shallow with the big bunker in the back. So other than that, it's pretty simple hole. That's all, right, <laughs> yeah, easy one. Work, work. Work a little right. No, he carried the bunker, carried everything. Carried everything. Bunker. Bunker left. 
Go. <laughs> Bend it. Yep. Oh yeah, thousand bucks. Thousand bucks. Most unfortunate. I'll tell you what, this is one of those things too I like when you have two courses on the same property with the same designer is you get so many similar characteristics. So this par three has a lot of these bunkers as you see here that look a lot like the bunkers when we played the, uh, the big course last fall. And if one thing that we highlighted there was how challenging those bunkers and how challenging those bunker shots really were. Some really deep stuff that's almost hard to even convey on camera. But anyway, on my tee shot there, I definitely took the old, if you're gonna miss, definitely miss spectacularly. <laughs> but at least it's not in the water, right? Oh! oh. Not today. Oh, not today. All right, we got an easy one here. 225 downwind down a hill. <laughs> I like that line. A little short, not short supposed night. to hit two inches behind it, I don't think. <laughs> It's got the hybrid. I'm feeling thousand dollars. You got a lot of that. faith. I like it. <laughs> oh, it was a nice strike too. You know, I aimed that way thinking it would stay too. Yeah. All right, a real treat. We get to play with the director of golf here at Hamilton Farm, Drew Jordan. Drew, tell us a little bit about this Hickory course because we came. We played the Highlands last time, full 18 hole, full length. Now we're on the. Is it only USGA rated par three? Well, it was. You know what? I'm not sure if it still is. Okay. I know the USGA changed some of the standards about what can be rated, mm -hmm. but uh, for the majority of its life of 20 plus years now, it was the only USGA rated golf course being over 3,000 yards. Yeah, gotcha. That's pretty cool. Yeah, now talk neat. to me about the designers because we got Dana Fry. So Dana Fry and Michael Herdson went into business. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I think they've been in they've been in the industry a long time. I think they probably came together in the early nineties. Okay. Um, they've got some of the best golf courses Aaron in the Hills, world. Right? Aaron Hill, yeah. yeah, they had uh, a US Open a few years ago. Sure. Shelter Harbor is pretty yeah. spectacular. Mm -hmm. um, a so, couple golf courses in some Naples. Some interesting named ones too, like the Devil's Paintbrush uh -huh. I saw like Calusa Pines in Naples National. There you go. Spectacular golf courses. And of course uh, the Highlands in Hickory here at Hamilton Farm. And how long ago did they design these horses so they opened in 2001 so okay. uh, we're 20 years right now gotcha well are you gonna help us try to make a hole in one today for a thousand bucks we're gonna do our best hopefully make somebody some money there you go guys you heard it thanks Drew. go in the hole go in, the hole. Go in. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, so scared close it. scared it okay you gave it a little scare Drew, tell me about this hole real quick. We get the Sugar Shack, which is no longer a snack bar. Correct, hole number eight, uh, you know, 175, uh, just a small little bunker in front, falls front left, woods right, uh, big runoff over the green. Uh, so you need, really need to hit a perfect shot and uh, try and get lucky and make a putt. And when you said before that it gets easier, when? <laughs> <laughs> There's, uh, you know, for 10, 11, 12 are uh, less than five iron. Okay. Yeah. That's so good. Promise. Good news. So, some very drivable par threes coming up. <laughs> okay. This is where the phrase couldn't hit the broad side of a barn was invented. <laughs> Come on, you had to say that right now. <laughs> Here we it's go. A small barn at least. A small barn. Nope, there's the barn. You aim for it. Sugar shack. <laughs> so I you can hit the broad, hit the broad, broad side. I, of I just proved it right there. <laughs> <laughs> Your ball picked up a nice uh, bit of wood. bit of See paint. Mark? A little bit of paint bit from of paint it. On that thing. Here we go. Okay. Up and down here. I'll tell you what, the sugar shack kind of saved you. Saved here. my life. Stop the ball. Too much? No, it could be good. Oh, uh, stop. I might hit the ball a little bit more. All right, eighth hole, so far our money is still safe. I tell you what, it's turning out to be a much more difficult course even than we thought it would be, but these holes are so pretty. Look at this one, you can just see that backdrop of the water that's gonna come into play. 10, water everywhere. And then you've got that beautiful view of the, the clubhouse in the background. So, if nothing else, the views are breathtaking. The golf, maybe not so much. 
Oh, go in the hole. Yeah, go in the back. hole. Get back. Oh. Go. Oh. 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 That was close. Oh. I don't think you could get closer without it going in there. I think that got some hole. <laughs> Did that hit some hole? I think it made a hard turn left on like the second bounce. Uh, that second bounce was pretty darn close. I thought it was going in. Well, we're going to see where that ball dropped. <laughs> if nothing else, you gave it a good scare there. I did, and now I'm feeling good. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, my God. Let's see how close that really was. Oh, wow, look at that, guys. Oh, <laughs> come on. That's so cruel. <laughs> I think you definitely, you hit there, and I think you just I caught think a I little just caught this a lip and Oh. So close. All right. We almost made somebody a little richer. Almost, almost. It's coming now. Look at some of these next holes. You guys are not going to want to miss these. I'm going to get a little shorter. Got to love a tap and birdie. Got to love that. All right, the boys had a jet. They can only play nine holes. We're going to continue on and play all 18. And don't worry because it looks like Mike's got the hot hand after Starting that. Starting to heat up after that one. Starting to heat up. Now I'm feeling good. There you go. And I told you guys, look out for this back nine because it just keeps getting better. Look at number 10 here. Wow, what a shot here. Surrounded by bunkers and water. <sighs> Let's hope Mike's hand stays hot because I haven't had it so far today. Who knows, maybe I'll heat up. We're gonna win you guys that money. But how epic is this place? 127.5, 127.5. That's the shortest shot of the day. Shortest shot of the day, Let's go. Oh, it hit the green, it took a back spin onto the rough. <laughs> mm. All right, we got green, but no hole in one. Okay, I like it. You know, can start funneling left. There's a little bit of a false front there. Oh yeah, Frank. Oh yes. Could it be? A roll back. Yeah, Good shot. Right. It, it slopes this way. You just don't get any roll. Yeah, you don't get roll there. You know, it's kind of funny. I don't even know if this statement totally makes sense, but it feels almost like you forget that you're playing a par three course. I mean, it's just so challenging. There's so much length out here. It just it it has the feel of a full you know a full length course. You just kind of forget that you're playing par three after par three because the challenge just kind of continues and like I said we're hitting almost every club in the bag I think the only thing I haven't hit so far Mike is a three wood and a driver yeah you know I kind of like these longer holes to be you know to be honest because we're, we're stretching out clubs we never use right Hit a lot of four irons today but right you almost forget you're playing a par three course you do you feel like you're just out here grinding <laughs> it out on a real you <laughs> know full exactly track what it feels like yeah I'll be good all it's over another here. great line oh, go in. It, it, it took a bounce right towards the hole and then it disappeared. But it disappeared because there's a slope there. I don't think it disappeared because it went in the hole, but we're going to see. We're going to see. <laughs> we just rolled up on the green and look at this guy. Oh my God. Oh my God. I mean, how many, how many chances are you going to get today to be that close? Oh, I don't know. My heart is pounding again. Jeez, look it's at that. It's even closer than the last one. Look at that. Oh God. Oh, this guy wants to win some money. He wants to win you guys some money. I do. Let's Jeez. go. Let's get it. I, I want it now. I, now I want listen, it. Listen, I have never played with someone who was that close to hole in one twice. That means it's coming. Twice. That means it's, it's coming. coming. <laughs> oh, come on, guys. That's like. It's like a shoe and a half. Shoe and a half. I don't care what you do. Do not lose the lucky red dot I'm ball. Not you need that you ball. need to hang on to this ball. Okay. It has had two looks That's at my hole Wilson one. Ball. This one's going in today. This is going in today. <laughs> 14 hole. We got five holes left. That means there's 10 more shots at that hole in one. Unfortunately, guys, they're not getting any easier here. What do we got on that yardage, Mike? Well, the flag is at 187. Playing 170 with the slope. So you want to play a 170 number and just let it release hit the front of the green. Let it trickle right into the bottom of the cup. Okay. That's all. Let's do that. Oh, I like that it, it didn't turn. Yeah. It started, started where you wanted it. It started exactly where I wanted it. Looks like you might have kicked in that bunker. Okay. I like that. They were expecting you to get a hole in one. <laughs> like, Mike, what's happening? You're off your game. You haven't made a hole in one. I haven't one. made a hole in one today. I'm not strong. 
Oh my god, yeah. Is it leaking right? Just a, just a hair. This is a great shot, dude. Pin high. I like how we're disappointed with birdie putts we're, that aren't hole in one. I know. Right? We're a little upset. What's that's wrong a, with us? That, that's a tour pro response to that shot. We're, yeah. Yeah, you see when they throw their club? They throw their club. They got a 12 foot putt. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Mark. Another really kind of cool effect here at Hamilton is Hamilton Farm. You know, this, this was a working farm. And when we played the Highland last year, you could see, you know, a lot of the barn features that they left in place. And cool thing too is that you see that also out here on the, the par three course. They've got a couple of the different original barns. In fact, up at the, uh, the Highlands, they've got some of the original farming equipment that they had out there just uh, on display. But it's cool, it kind of keeps with that whole theme and realizing that this was a farm. So really like that little bit of a extra character that it gives the course. Look at that birdie, Mike. Hey, what are we doing? Tee box back there, man. All right, listen, executive decision. Sorry, I didn't even ask you. For the last four holes, and listen, I don't think the uh, subscriber audience, you guys are gonna mind this. We're gonna move up to the whites because I wanna give this $1,000 away. So we need to shorten these holes for these last four and give our best opportunity. So what okay. do you think? I, I don't think anybody's gonna argue with possibly winning money. Exactly. So let's so go. Let's shorten it a little bit. Now 113 playing 116. That's more my speed. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> We're not playing for score here. We're playing for hole in ones. We gotta go pin hunting. Let's go. Yeah. It's gonna be a good shot on a normal day. On a normal day, we'd take that. Go on, roll. All right. Come on, roll right now. Go ahead. But don't roll down. Okay. <gasps> Not bad. Not bad, pretty decent. We're not gonna get a birdie today. All right guys, two holes left. That gives us four shots, four more shots at it. And even from the whites, this one's a bit of a beast. Mike, what do you got? From the whites, we've got a 195 playing 185 down the hill. Don't wanna guess what the blues were on this hole. Let's just move on and try to make that hole in one. All right, Mike, they call this one the home stretch because you're in the home stretch. Makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> Makes sense. Real clever name. Come on, let's go. I still think you got one in you with that lucky well, red third ball. Third time's a charm. Third time's a charm. I think that's so good. It's a nice strike. That. It just didn't turn left on you. Nice left kick, but I'm just off to the right. You're still the only guy I know who can hit a barn with a golf ball and have it become lucky. Right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and that turns your game around for the day. <laughs> Hitting that's a barn. Good. You know what's funny? I think you hit the barn last time we were here on the other course, right? Yeah, I tried for the Barney. Remember the Barney? That's right. Did you Actually, hit it? You, I, I missed it, but uh, the guy we were playing with hit it. That's right. Yeah. I missed the barn. You missed the barn. <laughs> <laughs> I left it out. Yeah. Probably. Yep. You're right there with me. We're probably going up now for par, but it's not what we want. Yeah. Yeah, we should make this like uh, like an all-time thing. Like, if we ever get a hole-in-one, we just give a thousand bucks away. We should never stop it. If we ever get a hole-in-one on, on any channel. of our videos, we that's give a thousand. That's why you have, but you have to be a subscriber. Like, that's got to be the rule. Or something. I like that. All right. So if you're not subscribed, subscribe. Because it's so fun. Like, it gives us something to shoot for. Right. I mean, obviously, everyone wants an ace, but now I'm just like more want an ace. More. Yeah. Well, if we don't win it today, we'll let it ride. I like that. Okay. Okay. These greens are quick, boy. Mm. Ooh, so close. All right. All right, guys, headed over to 18. Before we do that, of course, we want to thank Hamilton Farm for having us out. Uh, it's just always a treat to get to play over here. It was a treat when we got to play the Highland course and then this today. Like I said, just uh, spectacular. You just don't see courses like this from a par 3 18 hole course. It's just Amazing, but we got one more shot at it for you here. I'll tell you what, man, if there's ever a chance to make it, it's on this hole. Those white tee boxes are all the way up. This looks like the shortest shot on the It's gonna be short. On the course. It's all water though. It's and, all and, water. And I don't want to lose Wilson, but guys, if I end up losing her on this hole, there she is. Don't think like that. We gotta be positive. Right, 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 right. It's going in the hole. It's going in the hole. Yeah, I love that. Let's go. 97.8 yards. 97. You like that hundred yard shot? I do. I love that hundred yard shot. Okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Oh, it looks good. That looks real good. Oh, just oh. stayed put. Pretty good shot. Did a good shot. Again, it's laughable what we're disappointed with right now. I know. Why am I mad about that? Right. 
Good enough. Good enough. Short. Oh, short. All right, listen, we didn't get it done, but we can't let you guys go without giving you something. You've hung on this long, we're gonna give you something. So hang on another minute. We got something for you. We're gonna give you something. All right, pro shop here at Hamilton Farm, amazing. I just raided it, found this brand new scorecard holder. $100 value, Frank, this thing is awesome. I almost wanna keep it for myself. But no, we're gonna give it to one of you. So here's what you're gonna do. First of all, you gotta subscribe. We're gonna give it to one lucky subscriber. Put a comment below, let us know if you want it. Say, I want the scorecard holder. And if you're subscribed, we'll pick one of you at random. By the way, the hole in one, Let's let it ride. What do you say, Frank? You want to do it? Let it ride. All right, we're going to let it ride. So we're just going to keep going. If we get a hole on the channel, we're going to give one subscriber a thousand bucks. Let's go. Yeah, you better be subscribed. That's it. Thanks for watching.